you gotta be kidding me. They're canceling Snow White. They're canceling, they're it took them long enough, I suppose. I kind of figured they would anyway for insensitive whatever. So you wonder what that codes are. That's that's for this. That's for the drop the taco shirt and any of the other shirts this week that you see at the Teespring store. Drop the taco, get in the car. Not you, not your taco, Brie, not your taco. We're not talking about, we're talking about the meme of the shirt. Thank you very much. We're talking about the meme and the shirt. You can also get the crop circles. What are they? Why are they? They come in different colors too. You got all kinds of different shirts. Definitely check out the, the merch on the thing and use the promo code. We're trying to raise the money for the Star Trek Las Vegas trip this year by, by selling enough t-shirts to... Get a nice room with an orgy tub. That's what we're looking for. I think that's what we need. We need an orgy tub. So what are the crazier, wokier than thou's upset over this month, week, second? Backlash over Disney's Snow White ride for lack of consent in true love's kiss scene. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Um, really? Really? Is the Disneyland classic Snow White next to face the cancel culture's wrath? It seems so. We're using 7news.com. I don't know which 7news this is. Dot .au. Is this Australia? This might be an Australian thing. The theme park in California reopened in Friday after a long coof coof lockdown. Well, the other one was open, though. I mean, I don't see what the difference was. You had one open with the other one. Just go to the Florida one. I mean, they were actually just open the whole time. And, I mean, science, right? Hey, we all like science. You guys like science. I like science. You like science. He likes science. I like science. Listen to the science. We're not talking about anything else. We're talking about the science. Of Snow White's Prince Kiss thing, re. Just re. Get over it. Get over it. It's a different time. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of this. You know, I'm not a fan of fairy tales. I don't think that a prince is going to come and save anybody, all right? And that's one of my problems with Disney in the first place. Is that it lies to little girls to give them this false idea that a man is going to come along and actually say that he's not. He's not. He's not, and don't, don't, don't confuse me for one of these ring screaming SJW feminist types either. No, no, I'm not going after men because they're, you know, being mad at daddy like those wackadoos. No, 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 no. I'm just telling it like it is. And I'm blaming Disney for filling the, the, the heads of young women with all these false hopes and things. But no, the prince, the prince's kiss breaks the curse, bring her back to life. That's the fairy tale, isn't it? It's a fairy tale. It's fantasy. It's not reality. Hey, maybe it was back in the day when it was written, what, 150 years ago, 200 years ago? How far back does Snow White go? I don't even care. I wasn't a big fairy tale fan. Unless it was something where, what's the one, what's the one where they devour the bratty children? Those were, those were pretty fun. Those were pretty fun. <laughs> Why not reimagine the ending in keeping with spirit of the movie? Because it's not tradition. Which one? The remake movie that nobody saw that I guess made a billion. Every Disney movie makes a billion for reasons. And science. And we like science here. This, this garbage, this garbage, we're, we're tired of it. Just put a freaking label on it and say, hey, if you're a wokier than thou religious zealot running around trying to cancel everything because it's offensive, you're going to be triggered. That's a them problem. Why are we bending and breaking to the, the weakest, most offended, most fragile people in society? Why are we caving to these people? I have no idea why we're caving to these people. They're offended by everything. They're never happy with anything. They're, they're not going to like it anyway. I mean, they're going to go and be like, well, it's so problematic. They're going to go and then they're going to be offended because of how it was before anyway, even if you change it. I can't enjoy Disney anymore because re and where, because it was problematic in the past and I can't get over it because no matter what they do, I'm going to still cry and complain and re and scream. Just, just, just stop. Just stop caving to these people. They're not going to be happy. They're not going to want to, to what? Support your business anyway. You're pissing off lifelong fans. You're pissing off people who might potentially come around and be like, you know what? Maybe I was a bit of a hipster back in the day. So you're not going to win people like me over anyway. You're not winning over the SJW types who just want to complain for their little, for their little what? Their endorphin rush on social media for being part of the group, for being wokier than thou, for being superior and morally and going around policing the entire crapping world. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. Just cancel, cancel. 
cancel culture already. Cancel SJWs. Cancel the ring masses. They're not going to be happy. I'm going to be happy once I hit the, the Las Vegas Strip in August. Whether I go to the Trek convention or not, who cares at this point? It's Vegas. Come and hang out. We're going to do a fan meetup out there. And that's what we're raising the money on the t-shirts from. Do you like my rants? Hit the, hit the like button. Subscribe. YouTube is not going to do anything to tell you I still exist. Because I'm wrong, think. I will see you guys on the next video, live stream, or wherever. And I'm going back to my live chat. Don't you go anywhere. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, make sure to hit that like button. And if you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye. Is that a survival skill or is that just being a brat? I'm not sure.